Hello! Welcome po sa webinar natin ngayon in which I will discuss to you how to compute or check your withholding tax using the January 1, 2023 new lower rates. Kasi kapag bumaba yung annual income tax rates, of course yung withholding tax rate then ng mga empleyado or employees ay bababa rin. So, this is for individual business owners, employers, and employees. Ang i-discuss ko sa inyo ngayon ay kung paano mag-compute or mag-check ng yung withholding tax daily, weekly, semi-monthly, at monthly using the January 1, 2023 rates and onward. Kapag ang monthly salary mo is 20,833, so wala po siyang withholding tax exemption. Kasi kung i-multiply to ng 12, hindi siya lalampas ng 250,000. So kung multiply natin ng 12 to 2833 times 12, 249,996. Kaya hindi siya lampas ng 250 kapag i-annualize natin, kaya zero yung tax na babayaran. Pero kung dito ka sa bracket number 2, kapag ang salary mo monthly is 20,833, Hanggang 33,332, so ganito po na-compute yung withholding tax mo. So halimbawa, meron kang 30,000 monthly salary, so ang withholding mo dapat is 1,375.05, which is 15%. So ang computation dyan is 30,000 minus 20,833 equals 9,167 over an excess. So, multiplied sa 15% rate was 1,375.05. So, dito naman sa bracket number 3. So, kung 33,333 hanggang 66,666. So, kapag 33,333 ang salary mo for the whole month, saka monthly kang kinakaltasan ng withholding, so meron kang 1,875 na withholding ka. Pero kung gagawin natin itong 60,000, so ang withholding tax mo dapat ay 7,208.40. So sa next bracket, level bracket number 4, between 66,667 hanggang 166,666, so kapag ang salary mo monthly is 100,000, halimbawa, dito ka sa bracket na to, so ang withholding tax mo is 16,875.05. So, ang computation dyan is 100,000 minus 66,667 equals 33,333. Multiply ng 25% based dito sa new rates natin ng starting January 1, 2023. Kaya tax on over or excess is 8,333.25. Dagdag natin yung fixed withholding amount na 8,541.80, kaya 16,875.05. Yung withholding tax mo kapag 100,000 yung monthly salary mo. So dito naman sa level na to, level 5, kapag ang salary mo between 166,667 hanggang 666,666 monthly salary, so, kung gawin natin itong 500,000 yung monthly salary mo, so, ang withholding tax mo dapat is 133,541.70. So, dito sa highest bracket ng monthly salary, 666.67, mayroong fixed amount na 183,541.80 yung withholding tax. So, kung gagawin natin itong 700,000, ang monthly salary mo, so ang withholding tax is 195,208.35. Dahil yung 700,000 minus 666,667 equals 33,333. So times 35% was 11,666.55 plus sa 183,541.80. Kaya 195,208.35. So kung gawin natin itong 1 million, yung monthly salary mo, so ang withholding tax is 
300,000 to 08.30. So again, yung taxable salary or compensation mo is net of SSS, PellHealth, and Pag-ibig Employee Share. And de minimis benefits pa 13-month pay, not exceeding 90,000. So yung minimum wage earner shall be exempt from the payment of income tax or withholding tax. So the holiday pay, overtime pay, night differential pay, and hazard pay received by such minimum wage earner are likewise exempt. So kung gusto niyo mag-avail ito sa itong Excel template na to ng withholding tax calculator monthly, you can register the link below. So kapag semi-monthly salary ang natatanggap mo, tapos meron kang withholding tax semi-monthly, so ganito po ang computation. So based dito sa withholding tax calculator natin, naka-base din to yung mga amount na to at saka percentage doon sa withholding tax table. So kung meron kang 10,417 yung semi-monthly salary mo, zero po yung withholding tax. And then dito sa bracket number 2, so kapag meron kang semi-monthly salary na 10,417 hanggang 16,666. So sa level na to, so kung 10,417, so the same, zero ang nababayaran mo. Pero kung halimbawa, 15,000 na to, so within, hindi siya ng 16,666. So, ang competition is meron kang 687.45 na withholding. Dahil yung 15,000 minus the lower base amount of 10,417 equals 4,580. Multiply ng 15% yung 687.45. So, dito sa next bracket is 16,667 hanggang 33,332. So, kapag 16,667 eksakto yung semi-monthly salary mo, itong 937, yung fixed amount, 937.50 yung withholding tax. Pero kung nasa 30,000, pwede mo semi-monthly, so ang withholding tax mo is 3,604.10. So, dito naman sa bracket number 4, kapag meron kang semi-monthly salary na 50,000, so dito ka sa bracket na to. So meron kang withholding 8,437.45. Again, ang computation is 50,000 minus 33,333 equals 16,667. Multiply to 25%, kaya 4,166.75 yung excess amount, yung withholding tax sa excess amount, I-add siya dito sa 4,270.70 na fixed amount ng withholding tax, kaya 8,437.45. So, dito sa bracket number 5, kung meron, so kung meron kang 200,000, so ang withholding tax mo dapat is 51,773.80. So, kung meron kang 380,000, Ang semi-monthly salary mo, minus siya ng 333,333, yung excess amount is 4667. Multiply natin ng 35%, kaya yung tax on excess amount is 16,333.45. I-add natin yung fixed amount na 91,770, kaya yung withholding tax due mo is 108,104.3. So kung gusto niyo mag-avail ito sa itong Excel template na to ng withholding tax calculator, same month, you can register the link below para ma-send yung Excel template na to. So dito tayo sa weekly paid employees. O kung weekly ka sinisweldohan at weekly kang binabawasan ng withholding tax, ito yung withholding tax calculator computation. So, kapag 4,808 ang sweldo mo weekly, so zero the holding tax. So, kapag dito sa level na to, level 2, 4,808 hanggang 7,691, so kung gawin natin 7,000 yung weekly salary mo, automatic mo compute siya. So, 328.8. Kasi 15%, so ang computation dyan is 7,000 minus the lower base amount of 4,808 equals 2,192. 
multiply siya ng rate na 15% kaya 328.8 ang withholding tax mo kapag meron kang 7,000 weekly salary. So dito naman sa level 3 bracket, bracket number 3, kapag meron kang 7,692 na weekly salary hanggang 15,384, so gawin natin 15,000 yung weekly salary mo kasi di naman siya lampas ng 15,384. So kung halimbawa meron kang 15,000, so ang withholding tax niyan is 1,894.20. So, ganun din ang competition dyan. 15,000 minus 7,692. Yung over and excess amount is 7,308. Multiply to 20% plus the fixed amount of withholding tax na 432.60. Kaya ang withholding tax due mo is 1,894.20. So, dito sa bracket number 4 or level number 4, Kapag meron kang weekly salary na 15,385 hanggang 38,461, so alimba 15,385, 1,971.20. Pero kung gagawin natin itong 20,000 kasi pwede pa in between siya ng 15,385 to 38,461, so gawin natin 20,000 ang weekly salary mo, so automatic siya mag-compute. Dapat ang withholding tax mo lang is 3,124.95 kapag 20,000 ang weekly salary. And then kapag dito sa level 5 or bracket number 5, 38,462 hanggang 153,845 weekly salary. So kung 38,462 ang weekly salary mo, 7,740.45. And then dito sa highest bracket na number 6, kapag 153,846 or more, 42,355.65 ang sell withholding tax mo. Kung gagawin natin itong 200,000, so ang withholding tax is 58,509.55. So kung meron kang daily salary na 685, so wala pong withholding tax dapat. So dito sa second bracket or second level, kapag may daily salary ka na between 685 to 1,095, so halimbawa 1,000, so ang withholding tax mo dapat is 47.25. So ang computation dyan is 1,000 minus 685 equals 315 yung excess amount. Multiply to 15%. Kaya 47.25 yung withholding tax mo. So dito naman sa level 3 or bracket number 3, kapag daily salary mo between 1,096 to 2,191, so gawin natin 2,000 to, yun yung daily salary mo. So automatic, ang withholding tax na na-compute is 242,045. So, simple lang din ang computation, 2,000 minus the lower base amount of 1,096 equals 904 over an excess. Multiply to 20%. Kaya the result is 180 plus a fixed amount na 61.65 kaya 242.45 yung withholding tax. And then dito sa level 4 of bracket number 4, between 2,192 hanggang 5,478 na daily salary, kapag gawin natin itong 3,000 yung daily salary mo, so automatic mag-compute 482.85 yung withholding tax. So kapag ito namang bracket na to 5,479 to 21,917 na daily salary, so kung gawin natin itong 20,000 dito sa bracket na to, okay lang dahil hindi naman siya lampas ng 21,917. So ang withholding tax daily is 5,458.90. So dito, kapag excess na ng 21,918 yung salary mo, dito muna siya ilalagay. So halimbawa, gawin natin 25,000, so 7,133. Yun po yung sa withholding tax sa daily salary. So take note na itong taxable salary compensation, niche siya ng SSS, Health and Pag-ibig Employee Share. 
de minimis benefits at saka 13 month pay na hindi nag-exceed ng 90,000. So kung gusto niyo mag-avail ito sa itong Excel template na to ng withholding tax calculator, daily, weekly, semi-monthly at monthly, you can register the link below para ma-send yung Excel template na to. Ang regular price nito is 990. So ang discounted price ngayon is only 490 for the first 100 na mag-avail.